take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. For defining categories, the international literature usually uses cutoffs of 115 to 129 as mildly gifted, 130 to 144 as moderately gifted, 145 to 159 as highly gifted, and above 160 as extremely gifted. Take our lead. In most countries the prevailing definition is an intelligence quotient, IQ, of 130 or above. Increasingly, however, schools use multiple measures of giftedness and assess a wide variety of talents, including verbal, mathematical, spatial visual, musical, and interpersonal abilities. Make your mark, take our lead. The maximum IQ score assigned by the Waze IV, a commonly used test today, is 160. A score of 135 or above puts a person in the 99th percentile of the population. News articles often put Einstein's IQ at 160, though it's unclear what that estimate is based upon. Take our lead. To further simplify it, an IQ of 75 means that an 8-year-old child will function intellectually overall at 75% of the average 8-year-old's intellectual functioning i.e., at an average of a 6-year-old level. As he ages, he will commensurately function intellectually as a 12-year-old at age 16 years. Let's help you make your mark. If the 10-year-old had a mental age of 8, the child's IQ would be 8 tenths times 100, or 80. Based on this calculation, a score of 100, where the mental age equals the chronological age, would be average. Few tests continue to involve the computation of mental ages. See also Lewis Terman, Alfred Bennett. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.